Luis Suarez, the controversial Liverpool footballer, is in trouble again. This time it's for biting a Chelsea defender during Sunday's games. Jake game, well, Joshua Robinson, you actually watched the game. What exactly happened? Well, it was, you know, all in an afternoon's work for Suarez. He, um, in an important game that affected Chelsea's hopes of a top four finish, they were involved in a tussle in the penalty area as they both went down, and Suarez appeared to bite Bernislav Ivanovic. Um, but the officials didn't see this. No, they didn't, and so he continued the game. And he, 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 wasn't, he wasn't called off, which is what would have happened if they had. Right, he would have been sent off if the official had seen it, presumably. And he later went on to give away a penalty in for, to Chelsea and score the last-minute equaliser. Okay, you know, this is typical Suarez. He's always, controversy has been chasing him throughout his career. I mean, wha he's done this before, hasn't he? Right, he was actually involved in a biting in incident when he was still playing at Ajax Amsterdam, uh, and he was banned seven games for that. Okay, will he be penalized for this? I mean, what's happening now? Well, I mean, it's the latest in a string of controversies. There's also been accusations of diving. There was the racism claim uh, by Patrice Sevra. And now the FA will likely ban him for the rest of the season. Liverpool has already stepped in and fined him and has condemned the action, but... I mean, so this basically means he really is going to actually pay a serious price for, 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 for this misdemeanor, so to speak. Absolutely. I mean, he, and he's been banned before for other incidents. And that's bad news for Liverpool, I should imagine. Absolutely. Um, you he's know, an important player. He's scored 26 goals in 37 appearances yeah, that's, this year. That's, that sort of sums it up. Um, but, I mean, okay, but also what's happened here is that this seems to have come at one of the first games after the anniversary of the Hillsborough disaster, what, 24 years ago. And that is a big thing in Liverpool's history. Absolutely. I mean, the, the tributes poured in over the weekend for, uh, for the anniversary. And even Suarez referenced it in his apology, saying that he felt sorry for doing that on such an important weekend to Liverpool fans. But Josh, I mean, you know, Suarez isn't the first sportsman to take a bite out of an opponent. He's not even the first footballer. We've had Jermaine Defoe, the Tottenham striker, in 2006. And of course, the famous case was Mike Tyson. Right. Um, that was some time ago, but still. Well, he, when he took a bite out of Evander Holyfield's ear in a major fight, and in a sort of ironic twist, since yesterday, Mike Tyson is actually following Luis Suarez on Twitter.